Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to talk about my art journal sketchbook, Stillman and Burn. While you can see me painting last page of the sketchbook. This is a first sketchbook which I was able to complete start to end properly and I feel proud of it. Talking about art journals, the specific choice of art journals can vary from person to person. Let me tell you a small story. Two years ago, I was on a hunt of finding best art journal suitable for me. I had seen so many cool sketchbook flips on YouTube that I also wanted to be cool like that. My main preference is watercolors and back then watercolors was the only art medium which I was able to paint properly. So I searched a lot in different platforms what journals are available. I live in India, so here availability of art journals which are 100% cotton paper, watercolor paper, cold press is extremely less. And so to find a good art journal was an extremely difficult task. Also fun fact, I didn't had full time job in those days. So to gather the money for one best art journal was a very difficult task. So I didn't purchase art journal and continued to paint on papers only. Then after two months, I joined in my first full time job and started receiving proper salary. In first few months of receiving salary, I purchased way much art materials, some great, some totally unnecessary for my art style. And so at that time, I came across this brand Stillman and Burn. And that is how I purchased the watercolor art journal. Stillman and Burn, this brand offers way a lot different CDs of sketchbooks according to paper specification. Also, it is available in various sizes. It is also available in hard bound, soft bound, and in wire bound, thread bound. <laughs> wow, so many types, different types. So far, I have used Beta, Zeta and Delta sketchbooks of Stillman and Burn. Beta is good for watercolors and gosh, Zeta is not much good for watercolors, but gosh and pencil colors I was able to work well with. Delta I haven't used much. As the paper, is not 100% cotton. At first, I had struggled a lot while using the paper. Thank you. 
I love how colors bring in my state of mind into the artworks. Oh, speaking about the colors, as you can see, I loved the initial background where that dark gouache layers mixed with the water bring out the transparency. I love Himimiya gouache. Whenever I open the lid of the box, it makes me very, very, very happy. By the time I was midway in the work, the evening sun rays came through the windows, but it gives the this particular video very aesthetic look. I love the color combination in this artwork. It's on point. The dark and pastels intermingling with each other with a beautiful contrast. I tried splattering some weight paint on the final piece and that brings a really cool dimension. Well, all these decisions I made spontaneously and I love it. This artwork is one of my favorites. I just want to hug it. I will give you this art channel tour very soon. Wish you all happy art journey. Take care. Stay safe with lots of love.